This turned out pretty nice. You don't see this every day, do you? Hey folks, welcome back to another episode of Having Fun with a Sawmill with Robert Milton, Hobby Hardwood. I'm Robert Milton, there's my sawmill, and we're gonna have some fun, because that's what sawing's about. Actually, what we're gonna be doing today is we're gonna be sawing up some uh, rainbow poplar. And rainbow poplar is poplar, which is not overly uncommon, but every now and then one will pick up some mineral in the log, bring those mineral colors up into the log. Pretty rare. Make some really beautiful wood. It's one of my favorite to saw. Not my favorite, but one of my favorite. So I'm going to be sawing up a few logs. I'm not going to video all of them. Um, just because you'll get bored. Um, hopefully we're going to have some fun today. Anytime I fire up the sawmill, I start to get a big old smile on my face. Until things start going wrong. Then I get a frown, which is an upside down smile ugly. Then I get mad. Then I stop filming. First of all, you got to get the log on the sawmill, which is not too hard considering the hydraulic mill. The log is set up the way you want it. It's about right. If I'm happy, you're happy. Drop the loading arm. There won't be any edging on this one. I can already tell it's got a big old knot right where I don't want it. See if I can see more of what I want. There we go. Much better. Ooh, that's a pretty one. This will be a pretty one. Lots of cracks in the sapwood on this log, so there's no reason for me to keep it. It's, that looks pretty good. Let's get her up 90. Yeah, I don't like this face. Try another one.
Yeah, first thing we got to do is figure out where the pretty part is, just like with most things. Figure out where the pretty is, figure out where the fifth check is, figure out where the stress is. Sometimes those are easy, sometimes they're not. Hobby Hardwood Wood. This is mineralized poplar, vertical grain sawn. It looks gorgeous. It's quite striking. You'll notice that once I move to the vertical grain pattern, the um, contrast in the wood almost made it look like some sort of a tiger wood or some sort of an exotic. It's pretty cool when you can do that out of a domestic hardwood. I mean, you got to admit, that looks pretty darn cool for a run-of-the-mill old poplar. That's what you can do if you know some of the tricks. Well, we got most of it done. I should say we got we got all of it done. Several packs of lumber. This one's the last pack, I guess. Not sure how much we'll have on it, but we'll have some. So, guys, I, I hope y'all enjoy some of these sawing videos I'm putting out. I'm trying to mix them up between sawing, excavator, plowing, tractor, just general farm stuff. If y'all like what you're saying, please hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. Uh, just let me know what you'd like to see more of. As they say, what content would you prefer?